and all such a splendid thing my dear all I need is you here nothing has been so clear now it's happening first time we met was when we were in chemistry class our freshman year of college and we were sitting at the same table on lab day and we weren't partners and Nick said that he noticed me but he was too shy to ask to be my my partner for the lab so a couple day or a couple weeks into the class he finally decided to make a switch slyly and just said hey guys why don't we make some switches and and then he just kind of enabled his way to to be my partner for lab so we met I guess it was the month of January of 2013. And then we started meeting up, and then eventually he asked me out on a date. was pretty awkward he um, he had asked me he just texted me and said do you want to go get crepes and I didn't know if that meant like a date or if it was just like a hangout I was a little nervous so I, it ended up being a double date I asked uh, a friend of mine to join us and we met it uh, we met at the gate one of, of the base of our school and when I got there he had found one of his other friends that were going out and he was nervous so he invited them to go with us and so we ended up going on an awkward double date. And by the end of the night, I got her to pay for our first meal together. So that was a score. He, uh, well, he thinks it's pretty smooth that I paid for the first date, so. You took me by surprise. first time me and Jackie said that we loved each other was in the middle of watching the movie Titanic. Um, we had been getting to the point where we were just saying, I really like you and I like you a lot. And we just kind of were like stepping on the boundary of it, but we weren't really saying it yet. And we were kind of snuggling and I just looked up at him and said, I love you. And he looked really shocked because I had said it first and I was afraid he wasn't going to say it back and that I overwhelmed him. But, but he said it back, so <laughs> it was okay. So today I am most excited for all our friends and family to come out and celebrate this special day. I'm most excited to interact with our family as husband and wife. You're like the sun taking flight. You are the early morning light. At the horizon I will wait. Your love, it illuminates In the stillness now Look at what we found You are home, you are home to me Nicholas, take you, Jacqueline, to be, to be my wife. I promise to be true. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All days and ever. 
all the days of my life. I Jacqueline take you, Nicholas. To be my husband. To be my husband. I promise to be true to you. I promise to be true to you. In good times and in bad. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I will love you and honor you. I will love you and honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. Jacqueline, take this ring. Jacqueline, take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the, Son, and of the, Holy, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Nicholas, take this ring. As a sign of my love and fidelity. As a sign of my love and fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the, Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Hey Jax, I love you and I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you. You're my best friend. Nick, I love you and I can't wait to do forever with you. You're my best friend. With every breath, love I promise for a lifetime. Forevermore, that I am yours, and you are mine. Oh. mindful and thankful for the many blessings in our lives, our family, our friends, and one nation under God. Today, God, you brought Jackie and Nick together in holy marriage. And tomorrow, both have answered a call to serve our great country as naval aviators. As they fly on your wing, give them resolve and strength Give us all courage to live our lives in a way pleasing in your name. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. I am Jim Kennedy. <laughs> I am the father of the bride. And... Um, I know what you're thinking, you know, uh, I'm old enough, to pro I look old enough to be Jackie's brother. And of course we know, and we look nothing alike, of course. Because right? isn't she just a stunning bride? I mean, just look at her. Uh, we're so very proud of her and accomplishments. <laughs> but I'm very proud to be Jackie's dad. And she very much made me want to be the father that she deserved. She is a natural born leader, there's no doubt and excelled at so much um, but I can I can assure you she is beautiful inside as she is out so um, I almost never had to get mad at her it's true but I said almost <laughs> like the time that she blew up her car because she forgot to put oil in it <laughs> I think Camilla was there on that one <laughs> but I wouldn't trade her for the world and not a day, go, day goes by when I go more than five minutes of thinking about her I was and continue to be awestruck by her. I can scarcely believe she's my daughter. Someone asked me this week, aren't you afraid, aren't you a little sad about losing your baby girl to another man? And I, I said, you know, I'm really not. Um, I don't really look at it that way. You know, I'm gaining a son.
and uh, I always hoped she would find a man who deserved her. And I have no doubt in my mind that she's found that man in Nick, Nick McCrory. Welcome to the family, Nick. <laughs> I mean, just look at him. He's, he's straight out of Central Casting good looking. <laughs> anyway, as a parting wish, I just wanted to say, in all ways and all things, may the one who has brought you together bless your marriage, enrich your lives, and deepen your love throughout the years. And may God's blessings be with you all. And thank you all again for coming. A toast to the Mrs. or Mrs. McCrory. Oh, sorry, and one more thing. Go Navy! Hey, what day is it? Today is Monday, June 8th, 2015 at 7.01 p.m. Where are you at? Here in Maui, near Lahaina. What are you doing? We are about to attempt a secret filming mission of Nick's proposal to Jackie. You got any last words you want to say? 
I uh, hope we can film this without getting caught. Do you have any messages for Nick and Jackie for them to see in a year or so? In a year or so, yes. Uh, congratulations, and we're very happy for you. And we like being sneaky and trying to make this a good experience for you both. Over and out. <laughs> we're spying. I gotta, I gotta know where they go. We're I'll get, I'll get it. Them. They should hire us for that stalking show. Oh, they're gonna go where I can't see them. We can start walking down there and kind of go spy on them. You ready? Operation film it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready to hold that camera steady? Are you nervous? I'm okay. I'm okay. You're okay. You're okay. All right. I trust you guys are going to do an adequate job of documenting the moment because this is well, a big moment and hopefully we're on so family nervous. history. Hopefully yeah. we aren't like, spotted. Stay cool. Stay cool. Stay cool. <laughs> you don't ever have to wonder when to slumber to the summer tide. I'm always on your side ah, So let's start a fire I want to keep you warm Come on and strike up the choir Throw open all the doors Oh, I'm going high And I've never been so sure So I thought Jackie was the one before we actually officially were a couple. Uh, it was that semester in chemistry class of 2013. She said that she grew up riding dirt bikes, and I just thought that was awesome. And we've just been together ever since, and I was just waiting for the right moment. And on the beach of Maui was the opportune moment, I thought. And that was June 8th, 2015. I felt really, um, I didn't really feel shocked, I mean, I, we had talked about it so I knew it was coming, but I just felt really excited. Um, I was really impressed with how he had done it. We were, we were on the beach in Maui, in Hawaii, and um, he had gotten me a Polaroid camera as something that I'd wanted for a while, and so he told me to turn around and take a photo of the sunset, and then he told me to turn around, so when I turned around is when he was down on one knee. So I actually saw him looking through the peephole of my camera, and so then I snapped the photo uh, on the Polaroid camera. So um, my first kind of shot of him was just through this little peephole, down on one knee, and, and he looked really cute, and he was kind of starting to tear up, and he actually didn't say anything, he just stared at me. Like he didn't ask me, will you marry me? Because <laughs> he forgot, so. Um, but I, I just felt really overwhelmed and excited, and um, yeah, I was just, I knew it was like, I knew it was meant to be, so. 